Well, that's congratulations. A good feeling for a Saturday night, getting back to winning ways after a few tricky results. Yeah, I think I think just picking up the points. Um, obviously, we changed sort of our style today, um, which I felt was necessary because we weren't keeping enough clean sheets. Um, and although we were playing pretty well in games, we weren't getting the points required that we needed. So um, we opted for a sort of different tact in the game, and I thought the lads responded well. Um, and at times at home, conceding possession is not something we're used to doing, certainly since I've been here. Um, but at work today, you know, I thought we had the best opportunities in the game. And when the, the sort of time counted, we managed to put one in the net and I thought we were solid at the bank. It's a first clean sheet in the league, which is great. I was going to say, in your eyes, is that almost as significant as winning the game? Yeah, because that's what we set out to do before the match. You know, we, we had a lot of discussions about making sure we started to be solid at the back because we were sort of required to score sort of two and three goals at times um, and win games. And at this level, that's extremely difficult to do. So it's just about trying and for us to try and strike that balance between attack and defence. Um, and it certainly wasn't one of our best performances um, over the course of the season in terms of the flood of airplay and, and moving the ball, but it was certainly up there in terms of defensive organisation. Getting the ball uh, to move it was not the easiest thing, particularly in that first half, but I suppose when you're playing Swansea you would expect that to a certain extent? Not the fact that they have a, would have a lot of possession potentially? Um, yeah, but the way we set up, I think if we set up a sort of traditional way that we normally play, then it might have been different. Um, but we felt that was the best way to go about getting the points, um, and, it, and it ended up being the case. Solid at the back today, but also you've got the creative players in there, haven't you? The likes of, of Houlihan and that. And did, you, did you feel all the way through that, even though they were having more of the play, that you were actually carrying a threat? Yeah, I thought we were the most threatening team in the game. You know, I don't think there's any questions, but I think when you look at the chances um, later on, then you'll see that most of the opportunities fall to us, you know, and we, we could have scored more. Um, but just delighted to get the win and really pleased for the players as well in terms of keeping a clean sheet um, and sort of breaking that run more in, which is good. And Bacani puts himself about, doesn't he? I thought he was fantastic when he came on. You know, he sort of set, set his stall out and I think the first second as he came on, the ball came up to him, just big and strong. Um, yeah, and he made, he made a real difference when he came on. How timely was this win for you? Because, you know, it had been six game, games without a win. Did you need to get another one before confidence began to be affected a little bit? I don't think confidence is really a question, you know, because I think our performances were relatively good in a lot of the games. You know, we went in Man City last week and performed really well against arguably the best team in the country. Um, so, yeah, confidence wasn't really the issue. I think what you need to do is just make sure you get points on the board, because at the end of the day, next week, nobody's going to talk about how we performed today. They're going to talk about who won the game, and that's the most important thing.